Good morning. Happy Tuesday. Tuesday, aka Ron Clark Day. So I'm so excited. <laughs> Um, we, I don't know if you didn't see, I think it was like my last vlog, um, Ron Clark is coming to our welcome back, welcome back breakfast today, um, to like speak and I'm just so excited, but I did order a book, um, because I said in the last vlog I don't have any of his books because just I've had too many books to read and so I don't buy books unless. I need them um but I get so many from my district that I just felt like I never needed one um but I always wanted to read one of those oh my gosh I have a bug bite and it. it's just so bad um anyway so I ordered one and it did not come in time I'm pretty sure it's gonna come in the mail today which is so unfortunate and I looked at like any of the stores in our area and they didn't have any <coughs> so I'm just gonna bite the bullet excuse me, and um, buy one of the books there. They're like $20, which is outrageous because I paid like $9 for the one online, but it is what it is. I guess I shouldn't have waited that long. So yeah, um, I packed my lunch today. I'm really excited. Um, I did a salad with some chicken and some olives on the side. Super random, but I had a can of olives in the pantry and it just sounded really good. And then I'm going to pack up my coffee right now. It's currently 6.40. I need to get going like here really soon because I want to make sure I get parking um, since we all go to like since everyone in the district goes to like the same place it, the parking is horrible every time we go there so um, yeah I think that's it I did sign up for the gym yesterday which is really exciting um, since we've moved I didn't have a gym membership anymore because the gym that I used to go to is just too far for me to go now um, and so I I wanted to all summer and I was kind of like going back and forth and back and forth and then I kept seeing the sign that said like $10 a month so I went there just to ask because I was finally like okay I just need to get a gym membership because I'm not good about doing workouts at home um or at least getting like a good workout I can't do that at home so I can sometimes but like especially when I'm in school it's just like I don't know I'm not good about it um but yeah, so we went yesterday. It was like $70 to... What was that? It was like $70 to sign up, and then that includes like your first and your last month, and then it's $10 a month, which I don't feel like is bad. And they have like a lot of cool stuff. Um, they have like a room where it's just like dark inside, and it's like most of their cardio machines, and then they just play a movie in there, which is like totally up my alley because I love to watch things while I do cardio. I don't know what he is doing. What are you doing? We bought him up, like one of the big huge bones the other day and he ate the whole thing in like a couple hours and then today he somehow just has like a big piece of it and so I was like, did you go hide it or something? So now he's been chewing on it all morning. Come on, bub. Axie. Come on. Anyway, I'm gonna go. I will let you know later how Ron Clark was and if it was as cool as I expected it to be. <laughs> I'll see you guys later. Hello, I'm back in my classroom. It is 4.20. Um, I'm getting ready to actually go change and put on my workout clothes because I'm gonna go to the gym. Um, I wanted to leave maybe like 4.30ish. Um, oh, my skin. Anyway, Ron Clark. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys. Oh, like my heart is just so happy um i did buy his book um while i was there which is like a lot smaller than i thought it would be but um he signed it and i got a picture with him this is vanessa run and it says ron clark and then the date um it was just it was the best thing ever <laughs> like he was so captivating he had no like a slideshow no nothing it was literally just him talking i've never had like a presenter like that please hold okay sorry um my friend was telling me she's getting ready to leave so getting ready to leave um but before i go 
as I was saying, nothing. Like, I've never been to a presentation that he, they, like, don't use anything. Like, they always pretty much have, like, a slideshow or something. Nothing. And I was so engaged for literally, I think it was, like, an hour and a half. <sighs> it was so good. Um, like, it was just, it was so motivating. Like, it wasn't, like, a bunch of, like, ideas or anything like that. It was just, like, so inspiring and like makes me want to just like spend more time really building that classroom community with my kids um and just i don't know it was just really good it's like really hard to explain everything because it was so long and there was just like so much to it but it was really good so um i got that book and then i have and the uh, and the and to the end of molasses classes or something like that i don't remember you guys know what i'm talking about that one's actually in the mail it should probably actually be at my house today unfortunately um but that one i'm excited to read too i don't know what that one's about this one's all about the bus thing and how like you're a certain kind of person on the bus and like i just want to be a runner um i just want to run and i just want to lead and i want to do great things so yeah, I feel like I'm like on high from just like so much like excitement. Um, that was like all this morning. Like we've done so much since then, but yeah. So I'm gonna go. Um, I'm probably just gonna continue this tomorrow, and then I will end it tomorrow. And then Thursday's the first day of school. So exciting things are happening. Um, I'm gonna show you tomorrow a quick like little bit of an update of some things that I've worked on or anything like that. Um, but for now, I'm going to go. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. Today is a teacher work day, so I'm kind of dressed down. Um, I just have a teacher tee on and some jeans. Put my hair up um, because I was being lazy this morning. My body like really hurts from uh, working out the last two days because I haven't really worked out much um, like recently, and so I've been doing like this stair stepper at the gym and. Oh my gosh, my legs hurt so bad. Um, so anyway, I just got in my classroom. It is just about eight o'clock. Um, my plan for today, so I have all day just to do whatever I want, basically. So um, I'm starting to make a to-do list. I wanna hang a couple of things that I copied last night, but I need to laminate them first up front. I was gonna laminate them at home and I was like, it's pointless to use my lamination for that, honestly. Um, I kind of use it for like more like emergency things or like if I have one thing that needs to be limited I'll do it, but I have like a whole small stack. So um, I need to start my plans for week two. So I'll probably get like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday planned out. Um, I need to plan my win groups, which is like when um, the second grade classes uh, rotate because um, we're going to start that on Monday yeah monday um i need to print out my avid calendars for their folders um i need to work on a goal setting sheet for the kids to keep in their binders this year um so that they can work on their essentials that or like they know what essentials they're working on and parents are aware of what essentials they're working on um i need to go get my curriculum um i need to work or i need to check my binders the like parent helpers put our binders together so i just need to double check that they're like what i want and i need to go get them because they're up in the office um we don't give binders out like our avid binders we don't give them out until after back to school night which is um <laughs> um like the second week of school or something i think i don't remember um we don't have it like before school and we don't have it like the first day or anything um so it kind of gives us a chance to like get to know the kids before we meet the parents which is like good and bad um and then i need to double check on supplies because i haven't gotten any supplies for this year and i need like pencils i need dry erase markers so i need to check on that um that's my plan for now and then I like used mouthwash this morning, which I've been using mouthwash like randomly. I don't know. I just found like a little bottle that I had that hadn't been opened. And so I just started using it. It's like Listerine, um, but I don't usually use mouthwash. And I used it last night and it was fine. And then today, I think because I like ate something right after, my mouth feels so like weird. I can't describe it, but it feels super weird <laughs> and it's driving me crazy. Um, yeah. Anyway. I'm gonna get to work. Um, let me show you what I copied. So, 
I think this is everything. Um, okay. So I made this on my Cricut. It's like a bunch of different things, but they are all put into one. So I have my goals, which I made for up there, if you can see that. I made another one and it stuck to the um, the transfer paper like really bad and it wouldn't come off. So I had to just throw it away. I think it was because I was using the strong grip and then it um, I left it on there for like a few days because I wasn't ready to put it up yet because I didn't know where I wanted it. So I don't know. And then where are we? It's going to go on the door and then absent in bathroom. So then their numbers will just go here at the end of the day and then um, if they're in the bathroom. And then I made um, these, which are based off of the Ron Clark Essential 55. I did not make these. It was a freebie on TPT. Um, I just took the ones that I kind of wanted and then I made them my own sort of um, because she has like blank ones in this pack. Sorry. Um, so I only did 14. And then I found these super cute little. Oh, I found this too. Which I need to laminate. Which I thought was kind of cool. It was a freebie as well. Um, and then these like motivational posters. Which I thought were cool. I'm going to laminate them. And then put them um, I think over by my door. Also, a freebie, if I didn't already say that. I just, like, look on TPT for anything I can find that's free. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what I've, I've got. I need to go laminate, so let's get going. All right, it is so much later now. It is 5.15. <laughs> um, I've been a stress case all day today, and my eye is, like, I don't know what's wrong with it. It's not pink eye because it's, like, not goopy. I'm pretty sure it's my allergies because this happens, like, all the time. Um, and I've gone to, like, the doctor before before like for it um and they said it's not pink eye it's just like my allergies um hence why i have like my fake glasses sometimes because like on school days i have to like cover it up or else people think i have pink eye so yeah it's like just weird that it only does it in one eye though it was kind of irritated this morning and then um i like stuck my f i thought i had a piece of dog hair or something in my eye so i was like kind of trying to get it out with my finger and then it was like irritated after that so yeah um I'm all ready for tomorrow kind of but I like I said I've been a stress case all day today um I like came to school being like oh I've got this like it's I don't have much to do today um it's not gonna be a big deal and I was very wrong um I like realized how much I just had to do and then like I wasted so much time on like little things that yeah so um a couple little updates i went ahead and i put their folder on their desk so i used the folders up until um we give out our avid binders at back to school night or after back to school night i should say so i've got the names on the table and i've got them a place to sit for now so i don't know if i ever showed you guys i'm pretty sure i did Maybe I didn't actually. I don't know. Um, I put up this on the door to have them pick a seat. So I have all the different options. And then I took this from um, Teaching with Ease, who is someone that I met like recently at a conference. Um, but she has like, um, the only thing is I just realized I needed to label my tables and I never did. Um, I guess I could just do that with whiteboard marker right now. And then this number is like how many seats are available at that table. Um, and then like this are like my scoop seats, my lap desk, I included those as well. And like for these kids, um, because they're like in the middle, I just did that because I didn't know. Since they, like I'm just kind of putting them places right now, I didn't know like where they would want to be necess- or I don't know what I'm trying to say. Um, I don't want to be like, oh you have to sit in a scoop seat if like a scoop seat's not that comfortable for them. It's different to say like, oh you have to sit in a stool today because for the most part like you would be fine in a stool, but like the scoop seats some kids like just don't fit in a scoop seat like correctly which is I mean it's perfectly fine they're kind of little so um yeah I didn't want to like force them to so I just have them sitting at like the long table right now and then I figure I can just let them sit and then I forgot I never did the beanbag chairs um for seating for tomorrow so I could also have uh, two of them go sit in the beanbag chairs um so yeah and then I also last night because I had those numbers that are on my door on my class jobs, but I really just didn't like the way it looked. Um, the colors were just kind of messy. So I used those over there and then I remade some numbers. So I just cut these circles on my Cricut. If you've seen like past vlogs, you guys know I hate cutting circles more than anything in the world. Um, 
and so I just did I had the Cricut cut the circles and then I just wrote the numbers on them with my hand and then I just did magnet pieces on the back I buy like the magnet uh, like tape stuff and then um, I just cut little tiny pieces of it and stick it on so that turned out pretty cool I do want to do like a little Google it um, thing right here where we can put questions if kids have any questions um, that we want to like Google we have a free minute then um, I wanted to do that today it's 5 15 so it's not gonna happen today um, but yeah so and I also moved these tables I had these ones oh excuse me I had these ones over there <laughs> over there um but I moved them over here so I could have like a little bit of a stage but I was trying not to cover that up because I used to do like my stage right here when I would do the desk stage stage um but I didn't want to cover those things up so yeah and that's how those turned out I think they turned out pretty cute um and then I've been working on blowing up this darn ball for the past like hour um it's this used to be the guy who works next to me it was his and then he doesn't work here anymore he like moved schools so my friend gave it to me because he gave it to her she gave it to me to use for tomorrow and I thought it'd be kind of cool it's huge like um I don't know that's like two drawers on the thing it's not like a little ball and then each of them has a question and it's just like to get to know you so I'm gonna do some sort of like get to know you activity with that in the morning and thankfully it is all blown up because that was not fun um I don't think I'm gonna go to the gym today since it is already 5 15 or 5 20 um I just kind of want to go home and like relax for the night um and just make sure like I'm ready for tomorrow I think there's a couple things I might do at home I don't know um I might run to Dollar Tree I don't know so anyway um I'm going to end off the vlog here um it's the last kind of summer vlog <laughs> it's not really summertime anymore but yeah school starts tomorrow so I will do a vlog tomorrow like talking about my first day and everything like that um I don't know how much like footage I'll get tomorrow but um, if I have enough, then I'll upload it Friday. And then if I don't have enough, I may just combine Thursday, Friday, just because I know tomorrow's going to be hectic. I won't, like, probably... I'll make time in the morning to, like, vlog a little bit. But we have parents come in in the mornings, and, like, they can come see the classroom and everything. So, yeah, exciting things. Um, I'm so excited for tomorrow. Like, I'm so excited to meet my kids. Uh, I currently have 28 students, and I'm accounting for 30 which is like the biggest number I've ever had um, in my own class. Like when I was student teaching, I had that many, but in my own class, I've never had that many. I have 28 on my roster right now, but I I have a feeling we always end up more with more on the first day or if not on the first day, like the second day of school. So I know that they did like registering a little bit different this year. So people said that it shouldn't happen as much um, for, or like people or people are on your list and then don't ever show up. That happened like a lot the last couple years. So I'm hoping that doesn't happen as much because I always hate to write names on things because then that happens and then it's just a waste. <laughs> so even for like their folders this year, which I can't really, like, really show you because it has like information on it, but I just did everything on like a uh, Avery like sticky label. I just printed it because last year I wrote it all on like permanent marker. And then permanent marker is really hard to cover up uh, when you want to reuse that folder for someone else because they could didn't show up. So I just did stickers because I feel like I can just super easily pull it up and then it'll all be good. So anyway, that's it. <laughs> um, I'm finally not feeling as stressed. Um, I was feeling good up until like lunchtime and then I don't know. I just like I fell apart. <laughs> um, I look like, really, really just kind of fell apart, but. I feel better. Um, I did not get nearly as much done today as I wanted to, which is fine. It is what it is. It was stuff that didn't need to be done today necessarily, so it's not a big deal. But yeah. So I will see you guys tomorrow on the first day of school. I hope you enjoyed this vlog, and if you haven't already subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button, and I will see you guys tomorrow.